All right, guys, it's been a while since I made a video, so I thought I'd make one. This ain't got anything to do with slingshots. This is actually about uh, building a fire. I'm out here in the, the backyard, actually, next to the, the woods, the swamp. And uh, to, I'm going to talk about these uh, magnesium flint bars. You see a lot of crap on TV, uh, especially if you watch Survivor, about people trying to use these. And they always use them the wrong way, and it really kind of just drives me crazy. So uh, I figured I'd make a video showing the right way to use it and also a, a little sterno stove I bought today at Walmart that works real well. It's kind of like the amber lit or the way I'm using it, uh, building a fire in it. But anyway, to start off with, all right, you've got the mag bar. The, be the, the, the good thing about these is they uh, are pretty much impervious to moisture. You could literally put that in a jar of water, leave it for a week, take it out, shake it off, and uh, use it and it would work just fine where a lighter or matches or something of course wouldn't wouldn't be like that unless you had them in something waterproof it is a hunk of metal you can't dent it ding it it's it's there it's in your pocket i've been using these things for shoot 20 30 years now and uh i've always had one and i think it's a great uh thing to carry with you uh just just if nothing else you know you should always have two or three methods to start fire and this is just another trick in your bag all right another thing i was gonna talk about is me and matt were talking the other day about birch and uh where he's at he has paper birch uh this isn't paper birch this is actually river birch but the bark as you can see just like paper birch peels off and i'm gonna peel off some of it and this is what I'm going to use as uh, my tender to get the fire going. So I've got a good handful now and we'll go back here. I'm going to hand the, the camera off to my wife and first off I'll show you what I've got. I've got a, a Walmart grease pot that cost about, I think it cost three dollars. I've got this sterno stove here and uh, it cost five dollars and ninety six cents. I've got a piece of fat wood that uh, I've already carved a few pieces off of. I'll, I'll get a few more pieces off of that and then I've got this birch so now that I'm gonna hand it to Tammy and she'll do the rest all right Jackie get back all right now that I've got all my, my fire stuff going here first thing I'm gonna do is show you how this works all right this folds out like this this is in the camping section at Walmart like I said I literally paid five dollars and ninety six cents for it today uh, just to see how how I liked it and see if it worked and uh, I liked it a whole lot. Okay, that just folds up there, goes in those little tabs, and you're done. All right, you can already see I fired it up one time. All right, your pan, your water, whatever, this has got, don't look in there, Tammy. That's got uh, water in it. Uh, so, yeah, that's all there is to it. Now, then, next thing I'm going to do, handy dandy pocket knife, and I'm going to shave off a few more pieces of this fat wood here now then I already did a, a video on fat wood so y'all know what it is all it is is resin rich pine I wish y'all could smell this it smells absolutely fantastic uh, I showed a video how you find it and for, for for starting a fire it is just absolutely as good as it gets so now then I'm gonna move on to the mag bar all right here it is all right now then the, the thing about it is is you need something like this piece of, of, of birch bark right here is absolutely perfect you need something to catch the shavings all right you put the you put this down use the back of your knife use the spine don't use the edge or you're going to ruin it and all you do is you scrape shavings off at the back of your knife just until you get a nice little pile and i'll show you if you can't see it i'll show you what i've got okay and see those little curls right there? All right, that's what you're looking for. On the other side, you have a flint that, that you use to throw a spark. All right, I've got the shavings in there. I take the other. And let me see. Of course, it's not going to go. Okay, now then I've got fire. Now let's get this in there. This wind's making things a little bit rough. Not too bad. And you can see the way that birch spark burns. You gotta have your stuff ready to go. Get over here, Tim, and get these twigs. Okay. 
Okay, now then, if you can believe this, and I have no reason to lie to you, that was not doctored in any way whatsoever. That was birch bark that I pulled off the tree. Magnesium shavings.